In the energy markets, price volatility has been rising, and the key driver for that volatility has increasingly been the weather. Let's take a look at natural gas, for example. North America is coming off a summer that saw stronger than anticipated cooling demand. The West is still experiencing extreme drought conditions, which has limited hydroelectric output. These weather-based factors have contributed heavily to a price rally and a storage deficit for natural gas heading into the fall season. In the case of the oil markets, Hurricane Ida's damage to U.S. offshore energy production makes it one of the costliest storms in terms of production losses since back-to-back -back storms in 2005, which cut production output for months, pushing prices higher. After Ada came Tropical Storm Nicholas and the Gulf Coast is left still trying to recover production. Renewable energy like wind and solar have compensated somewhat, but at the end of the day, these sources are weather dependent as well. Weather is a constant wildcard for the energy markets, maybe now more than ever.